Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am coming to you with another essentials video. Today I'm gonna to focus on my wardrobe essentials, the basics. These are the basic pieces that I have in my wardrobe that I turn to time and time again to kind of build a lot of outfits from. They are kind of my capsule items, the things that I would turn to if I were traveling and wanted to get as, as many outfits as I could um, into fewer items and kind of use them different ways, accessorize them differently. So I'm not gonna be getting into accessories. I'm not gonna be getting into a lot of specific um, pieces within each type of item. I'm just gonna talk about the basics, things that I think everyone should have in their wardrobe to kind of start um, getting ready and always have something to wear. So these are the things that um, I go to time and time again that I consider kind of my staple pieces in my wardrobe. So I'm gonna start off with the smallest items here, which are some camisoles. And these are from H&M. I have one in black, one in white. And these are such a great layering piece. You can put these under a cardigan. I could layer one right under what I'm wearing. You can put them under a jacket, a blazer. Um, just a really nice touch. You don't have to get lacy ones. You can obviously just get like a tank top style one, but I think something that's nice and flowy and comfortable that you can go from season to season as a layering piece to kind of start an outfit um, with, I think these are a great thing to have in your wardrobe. Along the same lines, I think t-shirts are a great way to go, um, especially an oversized tee. These are also from H&M. I have one in black and one in white, and these are just really basic kind of scoop neck tees that I wear with just about anything. I could throw them on with some leggings. I could throw them on with some jeans. I could throw them on under a blazer. They are just really, really great staple pieces to have to kind of build an outfit off of and something I consider to be a absolute essential in my wardrobe. The next piece I have is just a white button-down shirt. I have so many variations of this. This one is also from H&M. Um, this one I just like because it's really, really soft and it actually needs to be ironed. It just came out of the wash. But um, this is a great piece for layering over things, for layering under things. You could throw this on and wear it to work with a suit. You could wear it over a pair of jeans, leggings, um, under a cardigan, under a blazer. It's just the perfect kind of, again, layering piece, essential piece. Um, and there's so many different fabrics. I have a silk version of this. I have a um, Oxford version of this, but this one is just a nice soft cotton and something that I get a ton of use out of and I would recommend that everyone have in their closet. The next piece I have is a sweater and I, you can go for any type of sweater that you like, but I think sweaters, especially in transitional months like fall and spring are great essential. Um, this one is from Everlane and this is from their $100 cashmere collection and it's in a really um, simple neutral color since I really like neutrals. Um, I'm surprised I didn't pick out the gray one. I have this sweater in gray but I decided um, to go with the camel color just to mix it up a little bit but Love this sweater. I tend to go for crew necks. Crew necks are my favorite style sweaters, but I do have some others in v-neck, in turtleneck. It depends on um, what style you really enjoy wearing. I do like to wear a v-neck um, sweater with like a collar shirt underneath. That's a great look for work or just casually. Um, and I absolutely love sweaters as an absolute must have layering piece. Doesn't have to be cashmere. I would say any type of lightweight wool um, that you could wear from season to season is a great way to go um, or any other natural fabrics, but I love cashmere. So this is one of my favorites. My next wardrobe essential would be a blazer, and it does not have to be a black blazer, but that is the one I chose since it kind of is the versatile go with everything blazer. And to go with this, well, let me just start by saying you can wear blazers with anything. I wear them with jeans, I wear them with um, just regular pants, skirts, dresses, but to go with this, I did select another piece that I think is an essential. Um, in anyone's wardrobe, any woman's wardrobe, and that would be a um, little black dress. And this particular one is from Banana Republic. I love their little sheath dresses. I wear these to work. Um, but to have a black dress that you can wear to any occasion that calls for a dress is an absolute must in your closet. I have several of these, um, but you can easily throw on a nice black blazer over this and have something that you can take off or keep on to keep you warm. Um, and that really dresses that up. 
or you could just have a dress like this um, that you wear in the summertime if you're going to a wedding or you're going somewhere more formal and you just need a simple dress. A go-to little black dress is definitely a must and a blazer that kind of can go over top of that. If you can only have one blazer in one dress, those are the two that I would go with. And along those same lines, a pair of black trousers. These happen to be some ankle length trousers from Banana Republic. These are the Sloan skinny pants, I think they're called. Um, they are on me, these are the ankle length, so they are probably about an inch um, up from the, from the bottom of my ankle, but they're great for work. They have a really nice stretch to them. You can dress them up, dress them down, very, very comfortable. I love that they have pockets and um, they're just a really nice, simple pant. If you're gonna only have one pair of sort of dressier pants in your life, I would definitely go for black because it goes with everything. Um, but I have these in multiple colors and I just think they're a definitely definite staple in my wardrobe And then the other pants I could not be without and I have three pairs are jeans um, And these are the three my top three most worn jeans. I have two here from American Eagle I have some black ones and some sort of dark wash blue ones these I just wear um, as skinny jeans and they're just ankle length jeans they go with again anything and um, you can take the black ones and actually dress them up you could definitely wear them with a blazer for going out somewhere um, and the as well as the dark wash the ones i have are a little bit faded so these are not the ones i would wear into work on casual day but um, i do really like these they're just one of my most worn pair of jeans and american eagle does the most comfortable jeans that last wash after wash and when you get them on sale they're usually about thirty dollars a pair so whenever um mine start to go and i need to get new ones i don't feel bad about it and i'm so glad i found these because they fit really really well and again they are the skinny jeans and the other jeans that i have here are my other favorite pair of jeans these are some destroyed girlfriend jeans from the gap and i absolutely love these jeans they are so so comfortable so worn in um just really really soft and i love wearing these kind of rolled up with a pair of heels for going out with a blazer and one of my camis or you could wear them um just kicking around with a t-shirt you could throw a blazer over that certainly put on some sneakers and be a little bit more casual um but they are definitely such a great staple in my wardrobe. I could not have not mentioned these. And then for shoes, I only picked out two pairs of shoes because I felt like there are so many shoes I feel like would be essentials, but if I had to really narrow it down, the two pairs of shoes that I could not be without would be a black pair of booties or some type of flat shoes, but I love my booties. And um, this particular pair from Mark Fisher, couldn't remember the name. <laughs> um, these are my absolute favorite. Um, I wear these all the time and I can't believe how well they've held up considering all the wear that they get. So um, definitely something that goes with everything in my wardrobe and something that I can wear with um, pretty much any, to any type of occasion. And the other shoes that I think are a must are a classic pair of heels. Um, these are my go-to Cole Hans. They are um, what I wear to work. I have these in multiple different leathers and um, colors. Well, actually I have them mostly in black and nude, but I have them in the patent leather as well as the regular leather. And I have some that have like an open toe, but they all are pretty much black and nude, which I think are the two color heels that um, are a must in in any sort of shoe collection, but having a nice pair, if, you only, if you're not a heel person and you only have one pair for going out, I would definitely stick with black and definitely um, consider going with a patent if you can find some that are comfortable because they just wear really, really well and um, they look brand new uh, year after year. So love those shoes. So that is it for my wardrobe essentials. I could go on and on about handbags and scarves and all kinds of accessories to kind of build a wardrobe from these items, but I definitely um, think that these are the pieces that are my basics, the things that I wear kind of throughout the entire year, and I like to kind of add in those accessories, and I will be doing other um, essentials videos to kind of show you some of my blazers and jackets and coats and 
uh, accessories and handbags and all of that stuff um, in some of my future videos in this series. So stay tuned for those. If you have any questions about anything I've shown you, please leave it in the comments below. And thank you all for watching. I hope you all have a great week and I will see you in my next video. Bye.